I'm at it again. You bloody beauty. Out in the bush. Come up here to test uh, my gold bucket out to see if I need any refining on it. And look who I run into. Hey, everyone. Blue dog himself. And there's his blue dog mate that he sleeps with. <laughs> hey? You know why he calls it blue dog prospecting? Because he never goes anywhere without his missus. <laughs> yeah, I'm walking up the creek. I left a bit before the boys because I'm a bit older than them. They're having a cuppa. All right, I'll just walk up here and listen to the bush. Probably all you heard was me panting. Anyway, get up when we get there. Well, as you can see, there's been a bit of activity here. The boys have been digging in the creek. Don't know if they found anything, but they've done some work. So, I tell they must have found something. You wouldn't dig that much if you weren't finding anything. All right, we'll get up the road. Trail. I've been going over a couple of cracks on the way up. And I swung the detector over this area here and got a little bit of a signal. I scraped out that hole a bit. Got a bit of a noise in there, reaching about a 69. Jumping around a bit. So I'm going to clean that hole out properly and see where I can get anything out of it. Before I go up any further, I'll let you know what happens. Well, Grant and I have got up here. Blake's back there and they're talking to Zach, another prospector. Uh, we've got up to this spot here. We're just going to have a bit of a dig here today and see what we can pull out. A nice little creek, bit of a one running in the side there. Yeah, be interesting. See what we come up with. Beautiful up here this morning. Sun's just starting to come up over the trees. Just wonderful. All right, we'll get back to you when we pull some stuff out of the dirt. Well, I sucked out that hole over there where the nuggets were found yesterday. Did not even get a fly poop. Went down over there and sucked out a crevice in underneath the rock. Never got a fly poop. So I've come back here to get motivated by watching Blake and he's got more energy than I have. In the glory hole. In the glory hole he says, but I haven't seen anything out of it yet. It's a glorious hole this one. <laughs> yeah, he's probably dreaming. He thinks it's got hair around it. Hey. <laughs> That's why he's calling it a glory hole. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to go for a bit of a walk up the creek just to see if I can find a bit of a spot there to do a bit of crevicing next bunch of bedrock or something just see if the, what it's like alright, I'll get back to you when I get up there nice little water hole here you can see where the She'll be fairly rocking through there. And then all the heavy's dropping off here where it comes out and fans out a bit. So, But the trouble is, I reckon the gravel here would be that deep. It would be not funny. 
I'll have you on a couple of these big boulders like that one there. Maybe it might be worthwhile having a scratch behind, test pan. Possibly over around here in these places. Yeah. Might have a couple of test pans here, but first I'm going to go up there a bit further and have a look and see if there's anything more attractive. Get up there a bit and have a look around and might find something a bit better. All right, might, I'd like to find a good crevice going across the creek. It'd be the ideal spot. But um, anyway, I'll go up and have a look. I've been for a walk right up around the corner up there. Some beautiful bedrock. But uh, yeah, I just haven't got energy to carry all my gear up there today. But um, I wouldn't mind trying to work out how to come into there without having to walk up the creek. But anyway, I decided I might have a bit of a scratch behind some here, like it comes through, funnels through here, and fans out here. So this would be a low pressure zone here, drop out zone for the heavies, as you can see by the row of rocks here. So, I might do a couple of test pans in around this spot here behind some of these boulders. I reckon the gravels will be pretty deep here though, that's the only thing. But um, you never know, up against this uh, bedrock here behind those couple there, there might be uh, little crevices or something. Alright, so I'll have a bit of a scratch there and we'll see what we can get. I've got nothing so far today, but that's nothing unusual for me. I'm sort of par for the course isn't it right up let's have a scratch I'm heading back to the car and I thought just slowly looking as I go I see this bit of a crab just going across here I cleaned a few of the weeds out of it so I might uh, scratch a bit of that gravels out and clean it out a bit and see if I get something I've got nothing so far today good to know what I get well Clean that bit of a crevice out there. Not even a speck. Oh, I'll tell a lie, there was one little piece there I could hardly see, but at least there was a speck, I suppose. But it's the only speck I've got all day out of this creek. It's years since I've been in, it'll be bloody years before I come back. There we go. Not a speck. All right, Blake's down there. He's as confident as anything. There's nuggets here. Yeah, yeah. Nuggets. Yeah, and they fall out of your pocket. <laughs> yep. All right, catch us later. Well, here we are back at camp. Man, oh man, what a day. Blake dragged me up that bloody creek to the stage where I thought I was going to get a coffin back. But, um,. Yeah, what's the nav? Watch me watch say. Ah, uh, fourteen thousand steps. I did, and it's not as if it's on flat country either. Rocks. So this is what he got yesterday, is it? Ah, oh, look at that. Got that yesterday, but not a speck today. That's right. We're both in the same boat today, eh? Yeah, no, he done all right for you. See, the other bloke was with him, got a, got a bit extra too. Got a couple of nice nuggets. What's his channel? Um, Gold Whisperer. Gold Whisperer. Go on Gold Whisperer and see if he's got a movie up, about up here, and have a look and see what he's got. So, uh, yeah, I don't know if I'll be posting this because I don't know whether there'll be nuts in it, but I'll, I might. Never know. You've got to have some days that you get nothing. And then again, I, I'd like to have one day I've got something. I think all these fellas that reckon they get stuff every trip are full of it. <laughs> Alright, catch us later. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and hit the bell. Catch us all later.